It's a very difficult situation, as you know. The whole point about the roadmap was that it would give uh, five-week intervals uh, by which we could gradually reopen the economy, and the roadmap was set out in February, and we were very careful about the, the future dates. And the whole point about the five weeks, uh, Stephen, was that we would look at the data, the Prime Minister said very clearly, that during those five weeks we would look and see uh, how hospitalisation rates were affected, how infection rates uh, were, were moving, uh, and, and what the degree of uh, the demand, the challenge was, the safety. There's always a risk uh, element here. And so uh, the hospitality leaders, uh, business leaders I've spoken to, are very clear. They, they, they find it frustrating. They want to get uh, open uh, and up and running again. But they do understand that we have to do it in a safe way and we have to look at the science, uh, scientific evidence. We have to look at the data and that, that, that we shouldn't be rushing uh, to quick uh, and easy conclusions. And that's what we're doing. That's what we're avoiding. We're actually looking at the data. We're trying to do this in a very safe, measured way. And as I've said, on the 14th of June, we will have a decision uh, one way or the other as to whether we can reopen on the 21st. I, mean, I think we're very uh, attentive to the data and we don't want to proceed with the roadmap without considering uh, all the information that we have. I think that the numbers of, uh, of, of cases uh, is a matter of concern. But what does uh, give me some confidence is the fact that the vaccine uh, seems to be working. Uh, we've had millions, I think 60 million uh, jabs uh, have been administered, something like 24 million um, have received both jabs. And I think the, the effectiveness of the vaccine is what uh, I think is what can give us some confidence that we can reopen on the 21st of June.